Yo, what is up guys, it's me again, so today I'm gonna be making the second part of the tutorial, so basically today we're gonna I'm gonna show you how to uh, do information gathering using nmap, okay, so um, That's the second part of the video, the first part is using the get, sorry, get and uh, v get, w get, it's, it's the same thing almost basically So git, um, I'm gonna clone uh, from git, okay, so what it, what it is basically is you type in uh, git so oh my god git clone and then you want to type the URL like the git file that you wanna um you know just don't look at this okay I was just looking at the Python you know installation stuff and you know so what we want to do is GitHub and we're gonna install Nikto um yeah. So Nikto, basically, um, it's a it's it can scan uh, websites for vulnerabilities and stuff. So what we wanna do is we we just gonna clone this. You do that. Now we have a clone. So get clone. You paste it in here, and before you hit enter, make sure you hit uh, space because otherwise it 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 messes up. I don't know why. It's just a Bug something I don't know. So git clone uh, nikto dot git. So basically we're gonna get all of this. Okay, we're gonna get the nikto uh, program. So cloning into nikto. All right, we got all this. Um, the rating resolving deltas. You know, it might take a while for you. Um, it does for me. It kind of not really. But so I'm gonna clear the screen and now we have uh, a directory called nikto. So I'm gonna change the directories into Nikto. So now we're gonna see all the files here. So we're gonna go into the program directory. Now we're gonna do. Oh, oh! By the way, you gotta uh, install Perl first. It's it's you need to do the case. So install Perl uh, like that. I already had it installed. I just wanted to make sure you guys have it too. So ls perl nikto.pl so okay so this can this can this can scan a uh, websites for vulnerabilities vulnerabilities I can't talk vulnerabilities <laughs> so um we, we don't have root so we can't use the root option oh no no no, no never mind it's just uh for checking the root directory I think I have no idea so by, by the way you don't need root for any of these tutorials I don't have root so on my phone you know I don't have super user access so basically what we're gonna do is Perl Nikto again I'm gonna do volume up and W it's gonna then like you know do the latest command so Nikto so host name so dash H okay this is gonna stand for host name um so after that we're gonna scan I don't know, let's scan google.com so google.com and it started it so it's, it might take a while honestly but um so basically that's it y you can you can scan it it's gonna give you a lot of information but while it is scanning we're gonna come over here and since we already installed nmap you know it's it yeah and so what we're gonna do is scan Google with Nmap, okay? No, actually that, that might be illegal. I have no idea. I'm only doing I guess uh, legal, you know, like legally. So I'm gonna scan. I I think Nmap has a site called scanme.nmap.org. Yes, okay. So what we're gonna do is type in Nmap and then uh, the website you wanna scan. That's really basic, okay? It's not gonna tell you a lot of information, but it's gonna tell you some like you know. So it, it's gonna tell you the ports like three uh one three three seven. It's elite port. That's a lot of Trojans run on that port. I don't know why it's open. And ping echo. That's an interesting port. Um, a at is always open. You know because it's it's a website. Twenty two ssh. You know. So, oops. I mean yeah. Twenty two. So that didn't really give us a lot of information, did it? So we're gonna do this dash. Wait, okay, so we're gonna take a look at first. I'm gonna show you. So here are all everything you can do. So increase verbosity level. 
So it says use the uh, dash VV or more for greater effect. That's what we're gonna do exactly. So it's give it giving you a lot of information. It is so um it that wasn't really enough. We're gonna use this option. Uh, so you can see it over here. I'm I'm just gonna. It's over here somewhere. Trust me. So basically, um, <laughs> should be somewhere over here. I I may have I may have passed it already, but um, does not really matter. You're just gonna use it, you know. Um, OS scan guess or, or enable OS detection. I, I I do that sometimes, but it's not really important. So we're just gonna do O. Oh. Okay, so now we're gonna scan it. So fingerprinting requires root privileges. Oh, okay. Then I can. I don't have root, as you can see. So I cannot do OS scan. You can if you have root. All right. So this is gonna, you know, do all this. So it's it's gonna scan. Okay. It's it it will take more time a little bit because we use the PN option. I right, so we have scanned it. Okay. Let's look at Nikto. Nikto is still doing his job. Oh my god. Robots.txt. Okay, let's look. Let's go on Google and see if if we can. Uh, Google.com. Oops. Slash robots. Oh my. I can't type. I'm really sorry, guys. .txt. I'm sorry. Oh. So, yeah. It's gonna, it's gonna say the, you know, robots and stuff. So, um, sitemap data, yeah, user agent, Facebook, ex external hit, yeah, okay, um, so, it can give you some info, you know, Nikto can, it's, it's really an awesome tool, in my opinion, with respect to the creator, of course, um, so, basically, that, that's information gathering with Nmap, you can use a lot of more, like, tools with Nmap, like, slow lores, but we're not gonna do that right now since we're not trying to DOS anything, are we? <laughs> so we're gonna do easy. If you don't have slow loris, do this and easy install slow loris. So, yep, I already have it. So I'm gonna clear the screen. And slow loris, it's it's an awesome tool. It can D DOS or DDoS if you if you um do it with a lot of people. So. Um, or in a botnet, but we're not doing that since you know we're we're not illegal. So slow lorries, we're gonna use this option, the verbose um, dash v. After that, we're gonna do. I'm gonna do the port. I'm gonna put it on to eighty, and I'm gonna use um eight sockets. We could use uh, also proxies, Sox5 proxies. Those are the best ones. If you use proxies, always use them. You know, so I th I think that's enough. Um, you know. I so we're gonna use this option as well. Uh, where where was it? UA random user agents. So okay, and now I'm just gonna dust my own router. It's probably not gonna go down since I have a. I I just don't think it's gonna go down, but um yeah it's doing it's doing a job as you can see it's dosing right now. I hope I don't go offline. I might as well just stop this right here. So yeah I just you know I just did a uh, volume down hold it down you know and then C and that's a that's a keyboard interrupt. So basically um that's it for today's video. You could use Nmap with slow roars, but I really don't want to get into that because. That might be a uh, you know a little bit of illegal stuff so um I don't want to okay so hope you guys enjoyed this video smash that like button if you did comment down below what you want um in more videos you know and see you in the next tutorial.